that you meet when you're walking down the street. Oh, who are the people in your neighborhood? Gotta say right away without delay, they're the people that you meet each day. Hi, I'm Murray. Hi, Murray. And this is Ovejita. Hello, Ovejita. Well, what's your name? Uh, Terry Milligan. Terry, are you one of the people in my neighborhood? I am, indeed. I'm a paleontologist. Ooh, what's a paleontologist? Paleontologists are people who like to study the things that lived in the past. Oh, I huh? mean, way, way in the past. You mean like last Tuesday? No, millions of years ago. How in the world could you find out what happened millions of years ago? We do that by going around and looking for fossils. Fossils? Well, what are fossils? Fossils are actually things that lived long ago, or marks and other things that were made by things that lived long ago. Uh, I wish I could see some fossils right now. I just happen to have some. What kind of fossils did you bring? Hurry, I've got a part of the rib of a triceratops. A triceratops? Is that a dinosaur? That is a dinosaur. That's the one with three horns on top of his head. Whoa! Up there like that. Well, how do you know that's a triceratops? It's got these little holes that we see here. Whoa. And these that. lines that we see here. Whoa. This one is interesting. What is that? This is called a trilobite. Here's its eyes right here. Oh, I see the eyes. And this is its forehead right here. How old is that one? This one is about 300 million years old. 300 million years old? It's older than the oldest dinosaur. Here we're looking at a fossil of a tree. A tree? That's, That's a right. tree? You can see the stem here, mm -hmm. and you can see a branch coming out of the stem here. It seems like a rock. It is a rock because when something fossilizes, it gets buried first, mm -hmm. and then rain soaks down into the ground and picks up minerals, and then those minerals soak into the wood, and the wood eventually changes to rock. Whoa! Whoa what is that? This is dinosaur poop. <laughs> what? <laughs> and how old is that poop? Maybe a hundred million years old. Okay, Terry, I'm ready to look for some fossils. What okay. do I do? If we're looking for dinosaurs, we need to find rock that's at least 65 million years old. No problem, Terry, I'm on it. Looking around for some fossils. Oh, I found one! Check it out, Terry. It's a fossil. No, I don't think so. I think that's just a regular rock. Ah, darn. Well, I'll keep looking. Oh, oh, I think I found one. What's that in your hand? Is it a fossil? It is a fossil. Oh, boy. Oh, oh. Can we try to figure out what it is, Terry? You can. Okay, I'm gonna look closely at it. Check out the shape of it first. Mm. Look how it's nice and round. And it's got little cracks all over it. <gasps> hey, Terry, you know what I think that fossil is? What? I think it's an egg fossil. You're right. I am? <laughs> I make a good paleontologist. Wow. It's a dinosaur egg. How old is that dinosaur egg? This one is about 100 million years old. 100 million year old yep. egg? Wow. You're an awesome paleontologist. Thanks, Terry. I love meeting peeps in my hood. Good night, Ernie. Good night, Bert. Hmm? What's that? Hmm? Well, you need an extra blanket? No, I'm fine. Okay, Ernie. all right. Here you go. There you go. Have a good night. Hmm? You. You want a teddy bear? Oh, that's so sweet. Sure, sure, here's one for you. There you go. Have a good night now. Ernie, Ernie, hmm? Ernie? Yeah? are you okay? I'm fine, Bert. Well, who are you talking to? Oh, I'm talking to a dinosaur, Bert. A dinosaur? Yep, a dinosaur. Ernie, hmm? you know there are no dinosaurs in our bedroom. Oh, don't be silly, Bert. Of course I know that. That's why I'm imagining a dinosaur here in the bedroom. Oh, you're imagining a dinosaur. Yeah, that's right. Okay, fine. Good night. You know, it's a lot of fun, Bert. Fine. Yeah, I mean, first you have to think really hard about the dinosaur, you know. Uh -huh. And, uh, ooh, a, a, a tall dinosaur. Mm-hmm. Yes, a, a, a tall dinosaur with blue skin. A tall blue dinosaur with pink polka dots. And then, Bert, then you have yourself one great imaginary dinosaur. Mm-hmm. Mm, fine, Ernie, yeah. fine. 
<sighs> now go to sleep, okay? Oh no, Bert, you know, I think you should give it a try. No, not oh, me. Oh, come on, Bert, give it a try. No. Please, mm -mm. please, Bert, please mm -mm. imagine a dinosaur, Bert, mm -mm. please. All right, fine, 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 fine. <clears throat> Ernie, Ernie, if I imagine a dinosaur, will you please let me go to sleep? Sure, Bert. Fine, okay. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Imagination, mm -hmm. okay. Mm -hmm. I imagine a dinosaur. Imagining a dinosaur. Mm -hmm. Imagining a dinosaur. Here I go. Imagining so, a dinosaur. Imagining a dinosaur. So what does it look like, Bert? Hmm, that's kind of fuzzy, Ernie. Fuzzy? Yeah. Hmm. Well, I think you probably need to imagine harder, Bert. Oh, Ernie. You know, put more effort into it. Fine, fine. Okay, fine. Yeah, fine, yeah, yeah. fine. Mm -hmm. Okay, imagining a, a a dinosaur. He's big. That's good. That's He's good. big and, and harder, Bert. And he has a long neck. You're not doing it hard enough, Bert. Push, 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 push. Come he on, Bert. He has a long neck. Bert. <laughs> well, Bert? <sighs> Nothing. Nothing? Nothing. Hmm. Nothing. Yeah, I guess you just need more practice at imagination, Bert. Yeah, maybe you're right. Okay, well, good night, Bert. Good night. Good night, Ernie. I, I was never really good at imagining. You know that. You're, you're good at it. I mean, I'd love to imagine... Maybe a, a big dinosaur, an orange dinosaur with maybe a long neck, but no, I just I don't do that very good. <sighs> All right, Ernie. Excuse me. What, Ernie? If hey, hey! Ah, ah! Oh, did you imagine a big orange dinosaur with a long neck? <gasps> I did, I did! Well, here I am! Oh, boy, you know, I also imagined that you liked bottle caps. Ooh, I do! Oh, boy, and, 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 and pigeons? Oh, yeah! <gasps> well, imagine that! You just did! Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, I'm Amy. Oh, and Emma's Emma. And we're pretending to be paleontologists. Yes, tell them what a paleontologist is, Miss Amy. Sure, Elmo. A paleontologist is a scientist who looks for and studies things that lived a long, long time ago. Yeah. <laughs> oh, 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 what kind of things that lived a long, long time ago, Miss Amy? Well, paleontologists studied plants that lived a long, long time ago, mm -hmm. and animals that lived a long, long time ago, <laughs> and even humans that lived a long, long time ago. Well, what about dinosaurs that lived a long, long time ago? Oh, yes, paleontologists definitely study dinosaurs. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Well, can paleontologist Elmo and paleontologist Amy study a dinosaur right now? Well, sure, Elmo. Do you have any dinosaur bones we could study? Well, paleontologist Elmo has something even better than bones. What's that? A real dinosaur. Huh? Oh, 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 oh. What? <laughs> Whoa, you're a real dinosaur. <laughs> yes, I am. Want to study me? Of course we do. We're paleontologists. <laughs> oh. ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, what's the matter? You paleontologists have cold hands. <laughs> oh, sorry. Paleontologists. <laughs> D. <laughs> the size of this book. It's called The Big, 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 Big Dinosaur Book. I'm gonna read it right now. It's time to play Journey to Ernie, where Ernie hides in Big Bird's seats. Oh, wow, I love playing Journey to Ernie. I wonder where Ernie's going to hide this time. <laughs> We'll be hiding behind the biggest dinosaur. <laughs> right, Rubber Ducky? Mm -hmm. boom, 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 boom. Wow, a dinosaur clue. <laughs> Come on, cover your eyes and count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ready or not, here we come. Whoa. <laughs> I don't think we're on Sesame Street anymore. Whoa. Gee, that's either a very small pool 
or a very big footprint. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> a stream and a bridge. <laughs> I can go over it. <laughs> you hear that? Maybe it's Ernie. That doesn't look like Ernie. What was that clue again? We'll be behind the biggest dinosaur. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, that's the biggest dinosaur I've ever seen. And the only dinosaur I've ever seen. Excuse me, uh, Miss Dinosaur, is Ernie behind you? Actually, I'm a Triceratops. Oh. I don't know what an Ernie is, but let's see if there's one behind me. Uh, nothing back here but a few flattened ferns. Oh, well. Thanks for your help. Uh, keep looking. You know what they say. If at first you don't succeed, try, try, Ceratops! <laughs> I guess Ernie's behind a bigger dinosaur. Oh, whoa, it's getting a little hilly. Hello? Is there a dinosaur in there? Hello! Oh, wow, it's a leaf-eating two-headosaurus. And it's definitely bigger than the Triceratops. Is Ernie behind you? Uh, oh. Behind! Is it Ernie? Uh, no! no. Leave! <laughs> Where's Ernie? I don't know. That way. Oh, well. Better keep looking. Oh. <laughs> this hill is turning into a mountain. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, now the, the mountain's moving backward. <laughs> oh, well, now the mountain's moving forward. Oh, and backward again. <laughs> Wait a minute. Mountains don't move. I think I'm on the biggest dinosaur. <laughs> Ernie, are, are you, you behind, behind this dinosaur? dinosaur? You called? There you are. We found him. You sure did. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> it's Ernie. It's me. I know you anywhere. The when you laugh, that Ernie shirt and hair, the squeaking of your ducky tells us you're the one. Ooh. We found him. We found him. La 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 la. Our journey to Ernie. Is done. Oh, hey, thanks, Mr. Dinosaur. Call me Mr. Diplodocus, Ooh. and you may hide behind me anytime. Oh, very diplomatic of him, right, Rubber Ducky? <laughs> 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 yeah. Oh.